The International Cricket Council (ICC) was founded at Lords on the 15th of June 1909 as the Imperial Cricket Conference, with Australia, England, and South Africa as its founding members. In the beginning, only countries within the Commonwealth could join. These members were then joined by India, New Zealand, and the West Indies in 1926 and later by Pakistan in 1953. In 1961, South Africa resigned due to their leaving the Commonwealth, but they continued to play test cricket until their international exile in 1970. The Imperial Cricket Conference was renamed the International Cricket Conference in 1965, with new rules permitting countries from outside the Commonwealth to be elected into the governing body for the first time. Any new member elected to the governing body could only be an associate member with the possibility of being promoted to a full member. The first associates were Fiji and the USA. Sri Lanka was admitted as a full member in 1981, returning the number of test-playing nations to seven. In 1989, the ICC was again renamed, this time to International Cricket Council. South Africa was re-elected as a full member to the ICC in 1991 and Zimbabwe was elected in 1992. Until 2017, the most recent new full member was Bangladesh, which was elected in 2000. On the 22nd of June 2017, Ireland and Afghanistan were granted full member and test status. Membership is a hierarchy and there are two categories of membership, full members and associate members. As of the 22nd of June 2017, there are 105 members, with 12 full members and 93 associate members. The membership committee will consider all future requests for membership, full and associate, against an objective set of criteria. There was previously a third level, affiliate membership, which was removed in June 2017 with all previous affiliate members becoming associate members. Full members Full members are the governing bodies for cricket in a country or a group of associated countries representing a geographical area. All full members have a right to send one representative team to play official test matches. Also, all full member nations are automatically qualified to play Otis and T20 as. West Indies cricket team does not represent one country, but rather an amalgamation of more than 20 countries and territories from the Caribbean. The English cricket team represents both England and Wales and the Ireland cricket team represents all of the island of Ireland. Among these 12 nations, Sri Lanka, Zimbabwe, Bangladesh, Afghanistan and Ireland have played as associate nations under the ICC before becoming full members. Reference, ICC Rankings, 16 August 2018 Associate members Associate members are countries where cricket is firmly established and organized but do not qualify for full membership. There are 93 associate members. All associates are eligible to play in the ICC World Cricket League, a series of international one-day cricket administered by the ICC. There is also an ICC World 2020 qualifier that works as a qualification process for ICC World 2020 that occurred every two years until 2016. The next T20 World Cup is in 2020. Until April 2018, only the qualified teams were awarded 2020 international status. In April 2018, the ICC announced T20I status for all its 105 members from the 1st of July 2018 for women's game and from the 1st of January 2019 for men's game. An associate member must maintain the following criteria along with other administration requirements of the national governing body. Have a minimum of 16 senior teams and 16 junior teams playing in a structured competition or competitions. Must have access to at least eight cricket grounds, four of which must have a permanent pitch. In the list below, suspended members are marked. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Associate members with ODI status. ICC grants one-day international status to its associate members based on their success in the World Cricket League. The associate teams who currently hold ODI status are In winning the 2015-17 World Cricket League, Netherlands ensured they would become an ODI team at the end of the 2018 World Cup qualifier. 
The three other highest placed associates in this qualifier UAE, Scotland and Nepal joined them. In June 2018, Scotland and UAE were added to the main ODI rankings list, with Netherlands and Nepal to join them once they have played enough games to gain a meaningful rating. Topic: <laughs> Associate members with T20I status. 2020 international status is conferred automatically upon the four teams listed above with ODI status. Additionally Hong Kong and Oman achieved this status through qualifying for 2016 ICC World 2020. In April 2018, the ICC announced T20I status for all its 105 members from 1 January 2019. Therefore, all 2020 matches played between ICC members after 1 January 2019 will be full T20I. The associate teams who currently hold T20I status are equals equals former members